Hello and welcome to my commercial zoning presentation. Today we'll be taking a look at the development of site address 1205 Lonsdale Avenue in North Vancouver. The Lonsdale area has always been a point of interest for many communities and visiting tourists. Even today the area is booming with development, economic growth and potential for the future. Our lot is located centrally in the upper Lonsdale area surrounded by many retail stores, municipal offices, practitions, and other amenities. Not only that, but the rapid development of neighboring high-capacity residential towers and condos in the area leaves this charming high-traffic neighborhood to become the next trending hotspot in urban living. With this information in mind, let me present to you my proposed commercial design of the new modern industrial chic restaurant and bar for the lot 1205 Lonsdale Ave. This proposed design hopes to mesh a combination of modern day amenity with a passion for delivering a soulful dining experience in an atmosphere you won't forget. The lot's building zone falls under the 2C General Commercial Zoning Bylaw. This allows for the construction of a large variety of commercial use buildings including childcare, retail, restaurant, and some practitioner offices. I felt that given the size of the surrounding community, its growing development, and lack of finer dining establishments in the area, that this lot would serve as an ideal location for my proposed project. The lot is long and narrow in shape, with dimensions 60 by 159.9 feet, giving it a total surface area of around 9,564 square feet. The only setback outlined in the zoning code is in the rear with the 20 foot minimum, however the structure is adjoining to a pre-existing building on its north side. My proposed design would entail the complete rebuild of the site, replacing the current outdated single story establishments on site with the new two story restaurant and bar. The lower floor aims to take advantage of the corner lot offering a partially covered wraparound patio to take advantage of the Vancouver sun. It would also include the installation of exterior garage doors that can be opened further extending the indoor dining onto the patio given the proper weather. The kitchen and bar would be situated on the bottom floor for dining, while the upper floor would also feature a secondary bar and lounge. The proposed building offers over 9,300 square feet for kitchen and dining, with an additional 3,100 square feet on the rear of the property for on-site parking. Additional parking is also located alongside all neighboring streets. A landscape screen would also be required on the rear side of the property for the neighboring apartment residence's privacy, as outlined in the zoning bylaw. This timeline outlines expected milestones and completion times of various phases. In an ideal situation, if this project were accepted immediately and we could begin moving forward with the commencement of a client's signature, the completion date of the structure could be as soon as July 2023. From the original design phase of the building, I wanted to create something that complemented with the surrounding area and land. Being minutes away from the Lonsdale Quay and shipping yards being a part of Vancouver's history, I wanted to incorporate some of their features into the design. For this reason, I designed the project with an industrial feel using a combination of steel and brick on the building exterior to pay as homage to the port. I also wanted to pay a reminder to North Van's natural resources, implementing rustic wood accents while taking advantage of the good weather and scenic views through the use of garage doors, as mentioned before, and a multitude of windows on the upper floor to appreciate the area's natural atmosphere. Moving into the interior, I wanted to continue carrying these characteristics on. On the main floor, I am to achieve an intimate dining area with memorable decor using a multitude of natural resources and reclaimed wood. I believe that the contrast of the stone and steel with the aged lumber and large amount of natural light balances one another out. Entering the building would be like entering a moment in time with a history and story to it, rather than a sterile environment. The earthy tones would serve as warmth and comfort on the wet colder days while the openness and flood of exterior light through the large windows would leave a person feeling refreshed and appreciative of our place here rather than shut away from the environment. Thank you for your time and consideration and I hope you enjoyed this presentation.